Right. It's interesting, it's interesting that you say that because I remember, um, you know, two years ago when I was writing my PhD thesis, right, I was just like typing all the time. I spent literally like may maybe like eight hours a day just at the desk. Yeah. That was before I got the Apple Watch, right, which, you know, is nice because it it's a wearable. Yeah. You wrote a blog post about that, right? Yeah. It taps you. It's like, oh, it's time to get up. And then yeah. it's always a good refresher, like you said. Mm. Um, but anyways, when I was sitting down and typing all the time, what I realized was like, hey, it's like I got parts of my body that are hurting mm. that it's not engaged. And then I was looking up, I was like, oh, ergonom like having the right ergonomics is really important. Not, like you said, 90 degree, hand, like your arm in 90 degree, uh, shoulder rested, um, get those foot rest kind of things. Yeah. Uh, so that you make sure your legs are 90 degrees, some back support and, and all that. And, and then you can go much longer, right? Yeah. So what, but what do you think about those? Um, there are some like, uh, like I think it was on, um, I don't know if it's like one of it was on Shark Tank or one of those like uh, fundraising Kickstarter. Okay. Right. And then they're like I think Better Back. I think it was called. Yeah. Like, you know where you put uh, put those knee thing like it has two things that wraps on your knees, straps onto your back and then just yeah. like, forces yeah. you up, right? Yeah. Pushes you forward. Yeah, yeah. What do you think about those? Like, do you think those help or compared to like you know working out or whatever? Yeah. Um. To be completely honest, I actually haven't tried that. I've uh -huh. seen it. Um. And. I personally didn't buy into it, um, just because it's it's another accessory that you'll have to lug around with you, uh -huh. strap yourself in, right. um, and for me, it's it's more of the mind. So mm -hmm. like you train yourself to think that um, you need to do it, right? Right. So you need to sit up straight. You need to stand up. It's mm -hmm. time to you know right. move your body. Right. Um, and that actually has helped me a little bit more in the gym with my mind muscle connection mm -hmm. um, and just strengthening my ability to think on what I need to get accomplished. Right. Because if you're constantly finding, you know, shortcuts mm -hmm. to, to better yourself or right, whatever, right, right. Um, it becomes a habit. And right. that's not something that I really promote. Mm -hmm. um, I, I, there's a, a whole bunch of tools that are great for, right. for, for people who, who need it. But right. if you can just sit down, think about, okay, Today, I want to sit up straight for 30 minutes. Mm -hmm. That's it. Right. Um, and just train yourself to hit those goals. Um, try to reach those, those uh, little pointers throughout the day. Mm -hmm. um, it actually trains yourself for anywhere, not just the gym, but anywhere. Um, but talking about fitness specifically is when you hit the gym, you'll be mm -hmm. like, okay, you know what? Today, I want to do three sets of 10 reps for whatever exercise and you actually try to train yourself so that you can hit those mm -hmm. and mentally you become stronger right if you don't hit it you don't feel bad mm -hmm. um you just say okay you know what i'll, I'll get it next time mm -hmm. um and then that's the same thing for uh at the office right so it's like if you know today i want to drink five cups of water mm -hmm. um and you only hit three that's okay try it try it again tomorrow and, and you just build that um right that thought, tr right. that thought process.